Imagine you'd never eat chocolate again. This nightmare could come true because climate change severely impacts the growth of cocoa trees and the qualities of the beans. This is also the case in Uganda. In recent years, the weather in the country has been changing, causing severe floods and extreme droughts at the same time. So despite Uganda's high development potential in the value chain of cocoa, the lack of capacity to adapt to change is impeding the country to exploit its full potential. How can this problem be solved? Well, the Belgian NGO TRIAS, the Cocoa Consultant SOTO, and the Ugandan Bamba Cooperative Union will join forces in a two years project, with us aim to increase the climate resilience of smallholder cocoa farmers in the Bundibugyo district in the Ruwenzori region. This region produces the largest amount of cocoa in the country but it's also a very isolated region that is disproportionately vulnerable to climate change. Thanks to this partnership, the cocoa farmers will learn to adapt to climate change. TRIAS will introduce the Building Resilience Toolbox that will assist farmers in assessing climate risks and responding adequately to them, such as through the plantation of shadow trees and good soil and water management. The Belgian consultancy company Zoto will, in its turn, train the producers of the Buamba Cooperative Union in climate smart agriculture and support them on their way to organic and carbon neutral certification. Through this partnership, the Buamba Cooperative Union will be able to enter specialty cocoa markets, thus improving the income and livelihood of farmer members, while at the same time ensuring your daily bite of chocolate.